Hi, this is Andrew with Uify, and today we're going to be going over battery charging. For this, we're going to take the battery out of our Draco by pushing the button, sliding the battery backwards, setting the Draco to the side, and having our battery separate. Then we'll need to plug our charger in to the wall. So depending on what country you're from, you'll have different wall outlets. Uh, for mine, it's a US and Canada-based plug. I have plugged this in, as well as plugged the charger in. So once you have the charger plugged in, you're ready to start charging. For this, you can remove the cover off the front like so. Please make sure to replace this cover when you're done charging as well. We'll remove the cover like this, and now we can take our battery and plug this in. For the Draco battery, there is a battery status indicator at the top of the battery. To see what the battery is at, we simply click that button once, and you'll see the charge state. So, we're gonna plug this now into the charger itself. To do this, simply align the prongs and plug it in. As you plug it in, you'll start to see the lights going up on the battery. Depending on how far you've discharged or how high the charge is already, this light will be in a different place. As it charges, you'll basically see it scrolling up to the right. Once it reaches the end of this uh, scrolling across the bars, it'll be fully charged and will go off. If it is still blinking at four bars, then it means that it is still charging and you must wait for it to turn off. At any point, if you do want to fly the battery, you can fly it, but know that it will not be fully charged and may not give you the full flight time. So, we won't uh, wait for this to charge, as this charge can take about an hour, depending on how discharged the battery is when you plugged it in. So, we'll unplug the battery like so. Once you've unplugged the battery, please make sure to replace the cover over the prongs. So, there are two main error states that you may see on your battery. Both of these are related to hard flight slash over discharge of the battery. If your battery is too hot after a flight and you try to plug it into the charger, it might refuse to start charging. This will be seen by the lights on the battery indicator blinking when you plug it in. If this is the case, simply unplug it and wait for a couple minutes for the battery to cool down and then try plugging it in once again. Once it is cooled down enough, you'll see the charge cycle start normally. The other error that you might get is if you over discharge the battery. When you're flying Draco, you do have an OSD that tells you the voltage that you're flying at, as well as if your battery is getting low. So please pay attention to these indicators. If you do get caught in the moment and you do over-discharge the battery, this is okay, but you'll see one blinking light over on the left side here. This means that the battery is being over-discharged and will need a little bit of extra to get back to charge. So to do this, you just plug the battery in like normal, and when you do so, you'll see instead of the two blinking lights that I have here, one light blinking on the left. This is basically bringing the charge back up to normal charge before it starts the normal charge cycle. Basically, once this is complete and fully charged, you can use the battery once again. So, once you're done with that, you can put the cover back on the battery and take the Draco and plug your battery back in. Do this, place it down to the Draco and slide forward until you hear that satisfying click. When you're in the field, you can also check the charge state of all your batteries by simply clicking the power button once. Then, once you've seen that on your various batteries, you know that they're all charged, and you won't put a half-charged battery or a low-charged battery into the Draco. So that is the video for setup of the battery, charging of the battery, and using the battery with your Draco. Please head over to uvify.com for more information.